How's it going on, guys? I'm going to tell you today and encourage people to keep praying and sending condolences to um, Congressman Steve Scalise and his family. Steve Scalise is of the Republican Party. He's the House Majority Leader, and he uh, was severely wounded um, in a shooting in Washington, D.C. Um, the shooter was neutralized, and you hate to cheer for loss of life, but I'm glad the shooter was neutralized, and I'm glad he doesn't pose a threat um, to any leader of the United States anymore, be it Republican, Democrat, Independent, um, Libertarian, you name it. And Steve Scalise was shot in the hip, and he is still in critical condition, according to news sources, and he has underwent his third surgery, and praying that he pulls through. Um, and I commend President Trump for saying uh, Congressman Scalise is a fighter, and he um, Trump believes he'll pull through, so props to President Trump for his optimism on that. Okay, um, the shooter is a 66-year-old named J James T. Hodgkinson, and he was a Bernie Sanders supporter, but before I go any further than that, Bernie Sanders took to the Senate floor immediately after the shootings. He took to the Senate floor and condemned the violence. He condemned the shootings. He condemned the shooter. Bernie Sanders in no way is connected to the shooting. So props and thumbs up to Senator Sanders for going to the Senate floor and saying what you said. Also, thumbs up to the Capitol Police. The Capitol Police was brave, selfless. Actually, one of their officers was wounded as well, and they neutralized the threat. And the the baseball field was locked, and the guy, the shooter was armed with a pistol and a rifle, but had he been able to get on the baseball field, um, it could have got... The situation could have got a lot, a lot more serious than it was, and we would be short of a lot of congressmen right now. So props to... Um, Props to the Capitol Police for providing really good security and props that he that the shooter wasn't any more of a threat than he was. So props to that. So God bless the Capitol Police. So there there's crazies out there in every political ideology. There's nut jobs and evil people in every political ideology. This this has nothing to do with Democrat, Republican, nothing like that. Props to both the Democrats and the Republicans for continuing the charity baseball game, saying that the United States is not going to flinch and they're not going to cower in the face of evil. So I really appreciate that as well. So God bless Congressman Scalise and his family, and God bless America. I hope everyone's doing well. Take care. God bless them. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.